Welcome to the spoken tutorial on overview of open plc with ld micro. In this tutorial, we will learn about plc, open plc and ld micro, features of open plc, what you can expect in this series, the content available in various tutorials in this series, how to use the code files given in each tutorial. To record this tutorial, I am using Ubuntu Linux 18.04 operating system. To follow this tutorial, you should have the basic knowledge of Electronics and PLC. First, let us understand PLC. PLC stands for Programmable Logic Controller. PLC is an industrial digital computer. It is used for the automation of various electromechanical processes. A PLC program is usually written on a computer and then it is downloaded to the controller. PLC is programmed using special programming languages like ladder logic, function blocks, etc. Now, you may ask, why not use embedded devices for these processes? PLCs are designed to be shock resistant, suitable for harsh environments. Now, we will learn about Open PLC. Open PLC is an affordable open source hardware developed at IIT Bombay by the FOSSE team. It is designed to get hands-on PLC programming experience at an affordable cost. Open PLC can be programmed using ladder logic. Now, we will learn about LD Micro. LD Micro is an open source software. It is used to draw ladder diagrams and generate .hex files for open PLC. LD Micro was available only for Windows initially. The FOSSE team from IIT Bombay ported it and made it available for Linux operating system also. Let us go to the Open PLC website developed by the FOSSE team. Please go through the website for detailed information on Open PLC. In the home page, we can read more information about PLC and the motive behind Open PLC. The resources page has Git repository links for hardware designs and LD micro source code. The downloads page has links to download LD micro, AVR dude and USB ASP drivers. Features of Open PLC Open PLC has all the capabilities of an industrial PLC and is simpler to work with. It is a modular hardware. It uses ladder logic programming, which is one of the easiest and efficient. For example, it can be interfaced with electronic modules like relay modules, etc. These are readily available in the market. What can you expect in this series? Each tutorial is demonstrated with simple experiments using instructions of LD Micro. LD Micro has a simulation feature. It allows us to check the code before uploading it onto the Open PLC main board. This is helpful to avoid any hardware damage. Once we are sure that the logic is working, we can compile the logic. That is, to generate the .hex file for the same in LD Micro to upload it to Open PLC main board. In this series, we have used some custom modules such as traffic light module, switchboard module, heater module. Using these modules, we will check the working of the ladder logic that we have created on hardware. Open PLC can be used by anyone who is interested in PLC programming. 
for example polytechnic engineering and other technical students any hardware professional individuals who are interested in hands on experimentation now we will briefly go through the individual tutorials in this series the first two tutorials in this series explains how to install ld micro on ubuntu linux operating system and windows operating system how to install avr dude and usb asp drivers next four tutorials are about how to navigate and create a ladder diagram in ld micro how to simulate and compile that ladder diagram in ld micro about open plc mainboard and how to program it with the ladder diagram created then we will learn about open plc traffic light module and open plc switchboard module and how these modules can be interfaced with open plc mainboard in the next four tutorials we will learn about the most basic instructions of ladder logic contacts and coils we will learn about the working of normal coil normal contact negated coil and negated contact these are explained with simple examples using switch and led after this we will learn how to implement basic logic gates like not and or and xor using contacts and coils also about internal relay and output pin working of the set and reset coils all the above topics are covered under the basic level next comes the intermediate level tutorials here we will learn about one shot instructions arithmetic instructions move instruction and compare instructions we will learn about the importance of cycle time and how to create a virtual counter next we will learn about the different types of timers available in ld micro the difference between each timer particularly between t on and rto also we will learn when to use reset instruction after that we will learn about different types of counters available in ld micro we will learn how to create up down counter using ctu and ctd counters next we will learn about the working of open plc heater module how it can be used to learn some analog instructions available in ld micro one of the instructions is a to d converter read as an example we will try to regulate the temperature of the resistor on the heater module then we will learn about pwm instruction by controlling the speed of the fan on the heater module how to use the code files code files are available in the code files link of that particular tutorial the dot ld file can be accessed by opening them in ld micro using open option under file menu the ladder diagram can then be compiled to generate a dot hex file or you can download the dot hex file from code files which can be uploaded to the main board directly it is not recommended to download the code files without understanding the working follow all the steps as shown in each tutorial and understand the working of each instruction it is the better way of learning this brings us to the end of this tutorial let us summarize in this tutorial we have learned about plc open plc and ld micro features of open plc what you can expect in this series the content available in various tutorials in this series how to use the code files given in each tutorial
The video at the following link summarizes the spoken tutorial project. Please download and watch it. The spoken tutorial project team conducts workshops using spoken tutorials and gives certificates on passing online tests. For more details, please write to us. Do you have questions in this spoken tutorial? Please visit this site. Choose the minute and second where you have the question. Explain your question briefly. The spoken tutorial project will ensure an answer. You will have to register to ask questions. The spoken tutorial forum is for specific questions on this tutorial. Please do not post unrelated and general questions on them. This will help reduce the clutter. With less clutter, we can use these discussions as instructional material. Do you have any general or technical questions on Open PLC? Please visit the FOSSI forum and post your question. Spoken Tutorial Project is funded by MHRD, Government of India. This tutorial has been contributed by FOSSI and Spoken Tutorial Project, IIT Bombay. And this is Harsha Priyanka from FOSSI team, signing off. Thanks for watching.